What is up everyone? Welcome to Small Cap Crypto. Today I'll be showing you how to bond on Spartacus Finance or any Olympus fork for that matter. First of all, this is not financial advice and this is not even a recommendation of Spartacus.finance. Uh, I've not done the proper review of Spartacus.finance yet, so um, please don't take this as endorsement. I'm just using this opportunity to show you how bonding or minting uh, works for these Olympus forks, okay? Um, so before that, let's briefly, what does bonding mean? Um, the, the term is a bit confusing and, and that's why some forks like Wonderland used the term minting instead. Um, you're essentially exchanging um, an asset in return for, uh, in return of, uh, in return for the, um, the, the protocol's uh, token. In this case, it is the uh, SPA, SPA token, um, and there are two options for bonding here, which are SPA DAI and DAI. Um, so SPA DAI LP uh, means uh, it will take the LP tokens that you would have received when you provide um, LP via the chosen um, uh, ex uh, decentralized exchange platform uh, and, and give you in return a uh, like the, the SPA token. And also die token as well. You can just um, straight up give it die and in return um, get spa. Uh, why would you want to do this? Well, you you would want to do this if the um, the discount rate is quite good. Um, and discount rate, it's a bit like ROI. There's a vesting period. Uh, I believe it's also five days um, for Spotify of Finance. Uh, this is my first time doing it for Spotify of Finance. Um, and that means that after five days, you would get 15% more, okay? And the, um, why, and, and, and how, how should you decide is, you can compare it with the staking um, ROI, and if the figure is equal or close to or higher, then it makes sense to bond and stake. Why? Because um, when, when, you, when you bond, you get to uh, withdraw or claim your token um, uh, uh, gradually, right? The vesting period is uh, across five days, but uh, as time progresses, uh, you get to claim proportionate to the amount of time that has passed. What that means is that you will get the uh, token um, you know, at, at the time of claiming and immediately you're able to restake it. And that could lead to higher returns than just uh, staking alone, um, but it really depends on the rate, um, on the on the rate difference between um, staking and and the, the bond discount. Um, I might put up a video uh, showing how to calculate um, the uh, the returns of staking alone versus uh, bonding alone. You should never just bond alone and not stake versus um, staking, uh, bonding and uh, restaking everything. Okay, but anyways, let's get straight to it. So um, I had uh, my uh, my spa just uh, staking. I've unstaked it already. Um, so now um, it should. Oh, maybe it, it hasn't been. So let me just unstake it. Um, max unstake. I think it's already been unstaked. So let me just refresh this. Okay. Yeah. So you can see that my, my balance shows um, as here. And I don't have any uh, staked uh, spa. All right, so head on over to the bond page, and um, when you click uh, view contract, it will take you to the the decks um, that whose LP they will accept, right? So I need to supply um, half and half here. So um, I need to have spa and die because I want to get um, uh, this this bond because it has a higher ROI. But I currently don't have any dye, so what I'll do is I'll swap some of my spa into dye, so half of my um, dye into half of my spa into dye. Um, there's a neat 50% shortcut here. Awesome. So I need to approve the spa spend. Gotta love these um, gas fees coming from Ethereum <laughs> from $300 to three cents. Amazing. Okay, now that's been approved. 
cute um, UI as well. Okay. So we submit the swap transaction. Just wait a little bit and that has been confirmed now. Um, it should show up uh, in balance, in the balance. See? Just wait a few seconds. There you go. So I now have half and half. So I'm going to supply. So cl I'll click on max 9.5. Nope. I don't have enough die for that because the exchange rate fluctuates. All right, approve die. That one is fine. Confirm. Um, it's been approved, but it hasn't registered it yet in the front end. Okay, now it has. Now I can click on supply. Now I have to approve that transaction. Add liquidity. So when I provide um, liquidity that will be used um, for exchanges on this decentralized exchange platform, I will get in return some LP tokens, which are like um, uh, proof, which is like proof for me having provided um, the liquidity. So I'll wait for it. Ah, it's already been registered because I don't have any more SPA or, or DAI. I mean, these are negligible um, amounts. So now what I can do is I can click on bond. Um, it hasn't registered the LP tokens yet. So I'm going to just click on refresh right here. Yeah, okay. <laughs> it has, it's just that it's a very small uh, number, um, and and the LP number, you know, there's a calculation for it. It's um, as uh, it's not gonna be like proportionate to uh, the US dollar value or the SPA uh, or DAI value. It's proportionate to the size of the LP pool. Um, and so here, um, I'll click on bond. Click confirm. So it, sa it says here, right? Uh, if I provide um, that amount of LP tokens, I'll get 1087 SPA. And if you uh, noticed, uh, I initially had 0 0.9 something SPA, um, and that this figure is 16% more, right? But the magic of it is the magic of it. So right now, um, I don't have any claimable rewards, but um, I guess in some minutes, in, in a few hours, it will show up and I can claim an auto state immediately. Um, but of course, there's gonna be transaction fees every time, right? And uh, because I don't have um, an input like a, a huge amount, um, it's not gonna be, it's not gonna make sense for me to do this too many times a day um, because you wanna target target the rebate, rebase point anyways, um, because that's when um, the um, staking rewards are given out. Um, the snapshot is taken. So if you really want to time it, you time it um, at, at rebase time and you, you can know that by clicking on stake and it says here 6 hours, 56 minutes still rebase. So what I'll do uh, if I have time is in 6 hours and maybe 15 minutes, I'll go to this page. Um, yeah. Oh, they've got a, a neat a shortcut, shortcut here. Um, claimable, there will be some amount under here and I will, I will click on claim. Um, but I want the shortcut actually. So the shortcut, yeah, claim and auto stake. So instead of having to do two transactions where I claim first the spa, the spa and I have to go to the stake page, I can click on claim and auto stake, uh, which does what it says. Uh, it will immediately stake what I've claimed, and um, I'll, I'll I'll gain um, higher rewards um, from that, um, as opposed to purely staking alone. So. That's it. That's the tutorial on how to bond or mint on uh, Olympus Forks. Let me know if you have any questions. Um, and uh, as, a, as an ending note, um, the market is very volatile. Don't guide your decisions purely based on emotions. If you bought into tokens that you believed, um, then you know, remind yourself of that. Don't panic sell at a loss unless you know, you've really thought about it um, and also uh, if you were intending to, um, uh, if you were intending to 
get into this market right now at, at this current time when everything is red is the best time right remind yourself that um, it's it's at a discount you know think of it as discounts not dips if you were intending to uh, get into the market um, but that's just my opinion um, it's not financial advice this is purely um, educational you take what is useful uh, but you have to do your own research and you make your own decisions so that's it uh, this has been small cap crypto i'll see you next time